Hello. I thought I'd give a quick overview of how I started using, using Library as a YouTube user. Um, and, and that's as a consumer, not as a publisher uh, or as a content creator. I um, found out a lot about Library recently. And uh, yes, Library has some quirks. And as you can see on the homepage, there is some questionable content. Uh, there's a lot of content that's related to cryptocurrencies and things like that. If you're into that stuff, great. If you are a crypto hustler. Um, yeah, I mean, it's, yeah. I, I mean, there's a lot of these comparisons between Library and YouTube, but for me, they're completely different beasts. And I thought I'd just go over how I'm kind of transitioning from YouTube to library. Um, so I have an account on both. Uh, YouTube I've used for many years. I have lots of subscriptions, um, a lot of which I don't watch that much of, but I have certain channels that I do watch a lot of. And when a new video comes out, I, I want to see it. Um, and there is some crossover between YouTube and library. Some content creators are adding their videos to library as well as YouTube. Um, and what I'm trying to do is basically subscribe on YouTube to a, to a channel, uh, follow a channel on library, and then the same channel on library. Um, and then I use YouTube like I would normally. So could, because I have all my other subscriptions on there when I, you know, I, w I watch other things, people that aren't on library. So I'll, I'll watch that, watch them on there. But if I see uh, a, a new video from one of my subscriptions, one of my subscriptions that is on library, then I will watch that video on library instead. Um, so as an example, I follow Mike Zamansky on YouTube. He, uh, I subscribe to him on YouTube. Uh, I, I don't know, about a year I've been using Emacs and I really like his Emacs videos. Um, I started watching them on YouTube, but recently since I've started using library, when a new video comes out, on, on YouTube, I'll open up the library app if I'm on my tablet or my phone or the website, uh, the library.tv website, and then I will watch his video on library instead. Um, and and I don't unsubscribe on YouTube because I want to see when these new videos come out. Uh, I just, I just, I'm subscribed in both places. Um, and this way, you know, the on YouTube, he maintains his subscriber count because I'm not unsubscribing, which I think is important for content creators. And but I can watch him watch his videos on library, which um, you know, hopefully gives him a bit more. It's a bit easier to kind of contribute, um, just kind of passive contributions, and I can tip as well. Specifically, if something specifically I find interesting. Um, so yeah, it's just. You know, I'm not using library as like a crypto mining thing, but I do like the way that you can earn, you know, these these tokens, these coins, these whatever they are, um, and then you can give back. And, 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 you know, they can be kind of withdrawn by content creators and, and they can they can actually use that money. Um, so anyway, that's a quick overview. Rambled on a little bit. Short video, but I still rambled. Uh, hopefully I'll do some more videos related to this kind of thing. Uh, maybe some other stuff as well. I don't know. I just I just wanted to get this thought out there because there's a lot of people, you know, that are just abusing library and actually it could be a really cool community uh, and a really, really good alternative to YouTube. I mean, it's not there yet. YouTube is still so mainstream, but, you know, library is improving and it will continue to improve, especially with people putting decent content on there. And if that means cross pollinating from YouTube, I'm fine with that. I, I my ideal would be to get to a place where I don't use YouTube anymore. I don't use the YouTube app. I don't need to do all that Google business. Uh, and well, to be fair, I say need. I don't really need to now, but I like the things that I watch and subscribe to. Um, and th and there is a level of, you know, ease um, with YouTube that everything's just there. Anyway. Rambling more. I said I'm rambling and blah blah. Okay. Thanks a lot for watching and uh hopefully I'll see you another time. Cheers, bye.